When you walk past it, the room may look like an extended section of the Quincy Public Library, but if you stop and take a second look, you'll realize something different. Jan Little spends time volunteering at the Secondhand Pros Bookstore every week. She's part of the organization Friends of the Library. It's the group that maintains the store. No matter what kind of reading they wanted to do, we have any genre that you could mention. The store was created back in 2011 when the library was restructured. Prior to that time, we'd always had book sales a couple times a year, and we'd stored the books in between. But now we actually have a place where we can keep them and sell them every day. The store runs strictly on donations. Once an item is collected, it's cleaned, repaired, and recycled by going back up for sale. Every book, cassette, CD, everything, magazine, was donated by some person. Now when you hear the words recycled in books, you may think old school novel, but this bookstore may surprise you. These are very current books. In fact, the, one of the books I had to be on a waiting list at the library here for two months to get, and here we, now we have our own copy of it. All the proceeds from the bookstore sale goes towards the library. More than $16,000 has been donated in the last four years. The things that the library needs that are sometimes expensive and uh, may not fall into their budget. So the whole idea behind this is to recycle books, getting them into people's hands so they can read, raise some funds, and use them for the library and the community. Good morning, Secondhand Pros. Little says anyone that stops in the store can see the benefits firsthand. This is the perfect place for me, surrounded by thousands of books and people that talk about books and people that know about books. I mean, that's got to be heaven for a reader, really. Chris Aguirre, KHQA News, Quincy.